Hello everyone, welcome to grade 6 science class. In your previous lesson, you learned about the two kinds of mixtures, homogeneous mixture and heterogeneous mixture. Homogeneous mixtures and heterogeneous mixtures can be classified as solid mixtures and liquid mixtures. In our new lesson, when a substance is combined or mixed with water, it is usually classified as solution, suspension, and colloid. Mixtures of substance in water are usually classified as solution, suspension, and colloid. What is solution? Solution consists of a substance called solute and solvent. Solution is a mixture of solute and solvent. Solute is the substance being dissolved, while solvent is the substance that dissolves the solute. Let us take for example the mixture of juice powder and water. The juice powder is the solute, while the water is the solvent. Take note, water is a universal solvent. Whatever is mixed to water, it will always be the solvent, while the other substance is the solute. Another example is the mixture of water and salt. Salt is the solute, while the water is the solvent. Take note as well that a solute is not always solid. It can also be liquid or gas. And also, there are other solvent aside from water. It depends on the mixture. Another way of identifying if a mixture is a solution is when a beam of light passes through a solution, light cannot be seen. Why? Because the particles of a solution is very small, about less than 1 nanometer in size, that its particles are not able to scatter the light, shown in the picture with an arrow. Now, let us identify whether the substance in a solution is a solute or a solvent. Another classification of mixture is suspension. What is suspension? Suspension is a mixture in which suspended particles are usually visible to the naked eye. If the particles exceeds to 100 nanometer in size, it may cause the mixtures to appear cloudy. If a suspension is allowed to sit, the particles will separate from the solvent. Let us take for example this glass of milk. If you let the glass of milk sit on the table for an hour or a couple of minutes, the suspended particles will be visible at the top of it, as shown by the arrow. Another example is the mixture of sand and water. If you mix sand and water and let it sit for a while, the suspended particles will be visible at the bottom, as shown by the arrow. Another way of identifying if a mixture is a suspension is when a beam of light passes through it, light is visible, as shown by the arrow. The red dots on the picture represents the suspended particles. Another examples. Another classification of a mixture is a colloid. What is a colloid? It is a mixture in which the particles are larger than a molecule, but too small to be seen by the naked eye. Colloids particles range from 1 to 100 nanometer in size. Many colloids are capable of changing from liquid state to gel-like state. Examples of colloids are gel, cream, lotion, jelly, paint, and more. Another way of identifying if a mixture is a colloid is when a beam of light passes through it, light is visible, as shown by the arrow. 
Now, let us identify whether the mixtures are solution, suspension, or colloids. For more grade 5 to 10 science lessons, click the subscribe button below.